Hi, my name is Eduardo Ox. I'm the author of an MX package called EEV, and the name of this presentation is Bidirectional Links in EEV. Uh, let me present things in a weird order, uh, starting by the new feature, and then I'm going to explain the whole context. Um, the, one of the main features that we are going to see here is this function here, metax cla, and cla is a mnemonic for Q link to anchor. Let me explain, uh, let me demonstrate how it works. This thing here with the green angle brackets is an anchor. Uh, this thing between the in, in green angle brackets is a, is a tag of an anchor. And if I type metax cla here, it highlights this tag for a second and it says copy it to the kill ring blah 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 and this thing here is a link i can insert the link the link here i can insert the link in my notes and if i execute this thing this link here it goes to this anchor in this file if you have a recent version of ev installed then trying this feature should be very easy. You just need to open the, this file here in which everything is defined and then go to this section at the beginning of the file and then run the two block, the three blocks of tests that are there. Uh, this block corresponds roughly to what we have just done. This other block uh, is slightly different because it uh, shows some variants of uh, CLA one is with F install of a, instead of an A here. Uh, let me show how it works. If we type uh, metax E KLF or just metax KLF, we get a link to this file that does not point to an anchor. And if we type metax KLT, uh, we get another kind of link that it's a link to an anchor in the same file. And the third block is uh, is more interesting because it it lets people create links to files that do not that are elsewhere and that do not have anchors pointing to them. Uh, let me execute this because uh, this will run this extra here and display the target at the window at the right. Uh, this is one of the source files of a max. Uh, so uh, ima let's imagine that I want to create a link to this string here. Then I can type metax klfs, and this will create a link to a file and a string in that file. So if I type enter here, it says create a copy to the kill, the kill ring, and this is a link to this file here, and to the first occurrence of this string in this file. So, how does this work inside? Uh, when I was trying to write the documentation of this, I tried to write a summary of how the algorithm works, and I failed, and I tried again, and I failed again, and several times. And then I gave up, and I decided to write an intro, uh, a tutorial, this one, that explains everything but lots of details and lots of sections with try it that have examples that you, you can run to understand things, to examine how some functions work, some how uh, the data structures work, and so on. Uh, the problem is that sometimes we have several hy hyperlinks that point to the, to the same file. Let me give an example. In the configuration in, in which I am now, uh, in this file here, if I uh, the old way of generating uh, hyperlinks to this file with find here links would generate a temporary buffer like this. And then I, I would have to choose which one of these hyperlinks I, I find best, which one, I, which one I prefer, and then copy it to my notes. So instead of choosing a hyperlink, this thing here shows all the options. Um, and in the new way, uh, in Metax, Cla, and Friends, there's an algorithm that chooses the, the best short hyperlink by itself. And this algorithm is a bit hard to explain. Let me demonstrate it here. Um, again, we have all these options here of, of hyperlinks to this file. And if I type Metax, KLF, it chooses one of them. 
And of course, I can copy it to my notes. It's going to work. It's going to point to here and so on. Well, the title of this presentation was Bidirectional Links with EV. Let me show what I mean by bidirectional hyperlinks and how we can use this thing to create bidire bidirectional hyperlinks very quickly. Uh, I will have to use a smaller font. Let me open these two files here. This one at the left is a program in Haskell, and this one is a file with my notes on Haskell. Uh, how do I create a link to from to this file in Haskell uh, to put it in this file here? I can uh, put the cursor here at, in any position after this anchor here and type metax club. It copies this link here to the kill ring, and then I can go, can go here and either insert it with control y yank or insert it with metax kli that adds uh, a comment prefix here so this is a way to create uh, a link from here to there that in which every uh, comment has to be given explicitly uh, but I also implemented a way to to create the, the two links at the same time. I don't use it much. It's mostly for demos for, because it's impressive. I wanted to show that in this presentation. Anyway, uh, let me show it here. Uh, note that the, in this this file here, the point is here. In this file, the point is here. Uh, my trick is going to create a link to to this anchor and put it in this file and it's going to create a link to this anchor and put it in this file. So here it goes, meta x kla2, ta-da, it highlighted the two anchors for a second and it created these things here and inserted them with the uh, right prefixes, I mean the right comment prefixes. And that's it. So that's it. Uh, if you found these things interesting, uh, just uh, install a recent version of EV and run the tutorial either with this thing here, metax find client intro, or by running this exp, or open this file here in the, in the IV directory and follow the tutorials. And most things there are, are well documented. But the, the thing that I don't use much, and that is mostly for demos, which is the, the thing that create bidirectional hyperlinks, is not yet well documented, but the rest is. So that's it. Bye. Have fun.